visit ticketcompare.com. Compare prices, buy tickets, get to the game. Ticketcompare.com. Buying tickets made simple. I was in. Uh, I was watching it uh, about six inches away from Gary Neville in the Sky Sports studio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Taking the mick out of him, weren't you? All, all I time. No, he was. I asked, he said a funny thing to me just before the game kicked off off camera. He said, "You know, there's no way you can win this." <laughs> and uh, I was like, "Wow, that was mental." And um, he was. I mean, I think this City team for me will go down as the best City team of all time because for what to do that to United at Old Trafford to see Neville having a meltdown, and then for them to play one of my songs. Uh, a volume that was uh, <laughs> on, uh, offensive to the most hated man in world football. Uh, probably the greatest 48 hours of my entire life. <laughs> was an old thing to be better. He plays a song every before every game, don't he? Now, and it's, it's, become, it's become a rule now, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah I mean, you know, I, I, like I said, I've been watching these for, since I was seven, so it's. 43 years now and it, it's just to be part of it you know to be a little bit of part of the club is, yeah. it's like every kid's dream yeah because you're giving Pep a tactical masterclass weren't you after the game or so uh, <laughs> I've just been uh, we were just yeah we were, yeah. he's a dude though man I've got to say he's an absolute dude and he's a dude as well look at him um, um, yeah he's really he's he's how you would imagine him to be about football he's, he's crazy into it yeah, we obviously see him week in, week out covering the club and he's uh, pretty intense, but you know what I mean? Yeah. He, he, he loves he was, it. When I, when, I, when I first met him, he was intense about what I felt about the club and it was kind of, wow, if you like that with me, what you're going to with the players, but, you know, it, it, uh, it, it, the, the thing that we're seeing now speaks for itself to me. The biggest margin is 18 points to win the Premier League. You could beat that, couldn't you? And that was United. I think there was some, I read something the other day that if we're, look, let's not get too big for our boots here, but if, if we're 13 points clear when we play United here, we could win it that day. If that is a goal, that would be the that would be the best thing. But you know what? I'll take winning it on the last day again because I think, I can't, I can't see us, yes, Raz, I can't see us, um, I can't see us winning it by 11 points. I just can't. They're playing so well, it's really difficult to see past it. There's not even a hint of how it might even go to the <laughs> Yeah, 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 we stalled at three and a half, three and a half a week. Like, oh, um, uh, probably, probably. <laughs> Yeah, probably, probably could. Yeah. I mean, he's made for, he's made fucking enough for left back, yeah, sure. you know, yeah. and you know he's turned Raheem into like a goal machine, yeah, like player. a goal machine. Yeah. For a guy who was in the wrong place at the wrong time most of the time to be the guy's in the right place at the right time, and can still score two goals in a game. And not really, it's great. I mean, it's happy days. Yeah.